Hey everyone and welcome to Unboxing with Susie. Today we have 11 boxes of the Disney's Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas 25 year anniversary Funko Mystery Minis. Um, and these are the Walgreens exclusive figurines. They are just now putting them out on the shelves and fortunately somebody else got to one of the little boxes before I found them and so I was only able to get 11 out of this box but they should be 11 different figures as they were still in the Walgreens uh, box that they got it in from the distributor. So let's hope we get an almost full set. So these are the figures that you can get. Now each figure is 1 out of 12. So if you do get a whole box, you should get every figure in the collection. And as you can see, there are three exclusive figures to this set. Alrighty, let's go ahead and get started. Do have to say I'm, I really want to get the Pumpkin King or Jack as the Pumpkin King as I love Halloween. The end of it's not quite the end of August yet, and I'm already looking forward to it. Um, so yeah, so I thought this would be a good way to start off the holiday. several months early. Oh, look at that. Right off the bat, we have an exclusive figure. Now, I'm not 100% sure who this figure is. It almost looks like Jack. Oh, it is Jack in his uh, night attire when he is trying to figure out why he's unhappy. So that is an awesome figure and an exclusive to start off with. Super excited about that. Let's see if he'll stand up. Uh, I'm going to have to have him propped up there. He does not want to set quite uh, on his own with his head so big and his feet so close together. It's a little off balance. So let's see who we get next. And I should mention real quick that Jack here, at the night attire, the cap, and his uh, night shirt and pants, they are fuzzy. They kind of have like the, a felt suede type feel to them. So that is a nice addition to that figure. Oh, look at that. We got Sally. She is absolutely adorable there. Sally also doesn't want to stand quite on her own. So I'm going to leave her propped up there. Let's see who we get next. So far we're doing really well. We have Dr. Finkelstein. Finkelstein. I always want to call him Dr. Frankenstein. But it's Finkelstein. That is a nice figure in his little wheelchair there. So he sets up rather nicely. See who we get next. Oh, we have Jack in his normal attire. So I'm going to go ahead and set him next to Sally and the other Jack. There we go. So we have the two main characters so far. Alright. Let's see 
see who we got next. Oh, we have Beryl. And Beryl has his little hook. Now, his hook was a little crooked there. So that is something that you'll have to be careful of. And yeah, he's got the green hair and his mask on. That is a nice figure. Um, Lock and Shock are also part of this series. to say I think I know who this one is it's shock and shock has her little bear trap kind of thing or metal trap I don't know exactly what you would call it but uh, and the mask with the frowny face there and the blue hair that is a nice figure as well. Let's go ahead and put her next to Barrel. So we still need the Mayor, the Pumpkin King, Locke, uh, one of the toys, I think. Uh, Oogie Boogie and Zero. This feels like a small figure. So, oh wow, we got Locke. So we got all three of them together. Wow. That is very cool. I'm going to go ahead and move them down a little so that we can put Locke by Shock and Barrel. They can all go together. Again, Locke's um, axe here is a little bent, so that is something to be aware of with um, these figures. So, there we go. So, like four boxes left. that we have another exclusive it's oogie boogie with his dice and oogie boogie almost looks like he'd be glow in the dark wow that is a neat figure I do like the the attention to detail there on the dice and with the stitching on oogie boogie I do have to say one of my favorite scenes in the whole movie is when uh, Jack confronts Oogie Boogie. So, let's set him there. And we'll set Dr. Finkelstein up a ways and I will show you guys all of the figures as soon as we get done. I guess I'll just set him off to the side then. So let's see who our next figure is. Oh, it's Zero. Look at that. Oh, and look at his cute little pumpkin nose. That is adorable. And it looks like he's just floating along with the edges of his little ghostly body there. There we go. Set him with Sally and Jack. Let's see who we get next. Down to two boxes. Is the Pumpkin King going to be the one box that was missing? Let's see. But that does mean that we got all three of the exclusive figures for uh, Walgreens. So, oh, look at that. There's the Pumpkin King. There he is. Oh, he's so 
spooky looking. I absolutely love it. Oh, he's amazing. Let's move shock and barrel and lock down so we can put the pumpkin king next to the other jacks. There. See if he'll stand up or if he's going to fall over. Kind of feels like he wants to fall over. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of tilt him back up against the box. Yep. Oh. Lock took out barrel. Friendly fire. I'm starting to think my table's not very even here. Um hold on one second. I go ahead and set something behind. Uh lock there so he stands up better. There we go. There's Barrel. Last figure. Who are we not going to get? It's down to the mare or this little scary looking toy here. This is a light figure so I think it's going to be the toy and we're going to miss the mare. But let's see. Yep, it's the toy. I guess I'm fairly confident this was one of the toys that they made in Halloween Town to distribute on Christmas. Alright. So let's go ahead and just set him there like that. So this is an almost complete set of the Funko Mystery Minis. Uh, the Nightmare Before Christmas 25 year anniversary figures and the only one that we're missing is the mayor of Halloween Town. So there we go. Alright. And those two. So I really have to say that my favorite is uh, the Pumpkin King, but I do have to say the little couple of Jack and Sally there are also a close second. I don't know if you can tell, but their hands are kind of out to one another, so I think that's kind of cute. So, alrighty. So if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button, and if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up and as always you can comment down below and we'll see what we get into next time bye bye